Hi folks and welcome back to Old School Customs. So we this is part three of Doodlebug. And I'll give you a little rundown of everything that me and my son did on this and gave it a complete revamp in one weekend. So we took the bike all the way down to the frame. We welded on this bracket that the previous owner had sawed off. with a solid, I'd say it's a, like a 3 8 steel rod bent and welded in place. The motor plate was, the welds had broken and we welded on the motor plate, top, bottom. We sanded down the whole frame. All the rust spots were treated. It was primed with red oxide primer, many coats of blue rust oleum, sail blue, some gray accents, the fender, the plate, the sprocket, the kickstand, the rear brake, everything that was lightly rusty got cleaned, ultrasonic cleaned sanded, wire brushed. We degreased the motor with some motor degreaser from O'Reilly's two times and shot it off with the uh, garden hose and all in all I'd say it looks pretty good. There's no nothing slippery, nothing greasy. It's all pretty clean. The back tire when I got it needed a valve stem Put a valve stem on the back tire, filled it with fix a flat because I seen some sidewall cracking. Rebuilt the uh, inside here, the cable was not going in through properly, and there's still some kind of carburation issue. It's not as fast, not really sure what's going on, but I only took it for a test run. I'll take you guys for a test run now. So let's give this a run and uh, this is the part I like. I turn it on, first pull usually. Ready? Definitely something changed with the carburetor and I'm not really sure what. I'm going to have to look into that, but for right now, it's back to a running bike 
and uh oh the seat was boogered it rips and tears so i took um i took an old fleece old an old late an old navy fleece um this is what it, the back of the the back of an old navy fleece and wrapped this thing and stapled it and got a nice new seat that matches everything, all of our gray. So, that's where we're at with um, Doodlebug, part three. Thank you for watching Old School Customs. Please hit like and subscribe. Have a good day.